hello guys and in this quick tutorial i'll be showing you how to create this paper texture animation background in after effect you can use this paper texture animation background you can use it for pictures you can also use it for text so the first thing i'm going to do is i'm going to import my paper texture i'll be providing the link where you can get a paper texture just like this and as well you can use um google to get paper textures so step two is to create a new sequence so i'm going to my composition i'm going to create a new sequence 1920 by 1080 then i'm going to call it paper texture i'll click ok step three is to drag the paper texture into the composition so right now i'm going to click on my paper texture then i'm going to drag into the composition i'll press s for the scale and i'm going to reduce the scale to about 50 percent then i'm going to press p on my keyboard to bring out the position i'll click to create the keyframe at the beginning of the animation then step four i will drag and change paper texture position at 15 frames interval so i'm going to move about 15 frames then i'm going to change the y position just like that as you can see then i'm going to move for about another 15 frames that's at 30 frames i'm going to change the position on the x-axis just like that or i change the parameters from there as you can see so i'm going to move for about another 15 frames then i'm also going to change the y um, position just by dragging it over the shift just to maintain that straight line now try to zoom out then what i'm going to do now is um i'm going to copy the first keyframe we created i'm going to move about 15 frames So I'm going to edit and I'm going to paste. So I will drag and select over all the keyframes. I'll right click and I'll select toggle old keyframe. So step five is to write an expression that loops the animation. So I'm going to hold alt while I click on the stopwatch icon. Then I'm going to type loop out just like that. Let's have a quick preview. As you can see, we have our paper texture animating in the background. So the step six is to add lumetric color effect and adjust the shadows just to darken the paper texture a little bit so i'm going to search for the metric color in my effect and preset i'm going to click and drag over it then i'm going to adjust the shadows from the curves the reason why i'm doing this is to darken the rough part of the paper just to make it visible a little bit so let's have a quick preview here and see as you can see we've created our paper texture animation within three minutes it's simple and easy to do thank you for your time till meet next time